Hey, it's me, Georgia of Awesome. Happy Halloween. And today I'm going to I am going to make a nail video. And my theme is Elsa. And I'm going as Elsa, so we can get started. Okay, what kind of polish do you have there? Well, I am going to use Essie and it is and the name is Find, Find Me an Oasis. <laughs> and what color is that? It is blue. I know you guys are thinking it is white. No, it is not white, it is blue. Okay, what's next? Next, we have what, what and wild, what and wild, just glitter polish. <laughs> glitter polish. I don't know what the end is, sorry. <laughs> and I have this glitter. It is sparkle on top. This one is hmm. Stroke of Brilliance, I think. Stroke of Brilliance. And one more. It this one it is called this the, that what what I'm thinking. I meant. <laughs> I meant. It is a funny name. So these are all the polish. This is our color. It is really pretty. It is, it is new, I think. You gonna show them your nails? What have you done so far on your nails? I have two coats. You guys might want to know what brushes I'm using. I am using a, what's it called again? A small brush. Small <laughs> brush. Nail art a brush. Right brush. And why and are we using those small brushes? Because my nails are so tiny. Um. Okay. So you want to get started on the glitter gradient part of it? Sure. Okay. We can start with the glitter. We are going to use blue glitter, dark blue glitter, and light glitter. Okay. And I am using a sheet of paper just to keep the table clean. Okay. So. Let's use our stripe brush. In this part, we're just going around the top to get that sort of metallic in it so what <laughs> the, my mom is doing <laughs> is is putting on our first tiny stroke and what you want to do is go over the top like a french manicure but different you are going to go over the white part of your nails. Like the tip top of your nails. And you're going to go over that with your brush. Okay. With your straight brush. I'm blowing that. And you want to keep this one dry for a few minutes or two. You can blow on it. Just leave it there, but um, you don't want to touch anything. <laughs> I can touch anything with this because I haven't done anything with this one. It is very clear. Your nails. So this one was just to show you. Um, this one I did without showing you because um, I think you would understand this part fairly well. So we're going to brush through this. Normally we would let it dry between coats, but we're going to use this really glittery wet and wild to yep. start the glitter gradient. To start. 
just going to dab that on there. Dab, dab, dab. Because the nails are so small, we want to make sure it spreads. That we're getting the glitter on there. Normally, you just normally you would like just gonna put this on the out. sticker nail, but they don't have the in this store, and they only have French manicures and other things, but they don't have this theme, so you want to do this one. You can use any color, you don't have to use the colors that I'm using. Okay, so that's the first glitter that's in our the gradient. That's the first glitter in our gradient. And the second glitter we're going to use is the blue. The blue. I know it's funny we're using blue two times, but it is going to make it look very pretty. And again, we're just going to dab. Try to sweep. But the nails are so small that it's very difficult to do a whole lot of sweeping across the nails. We're just going to make sure that the glitter is on there. It's a good pass on the glitter. And you can kind of see the gradient starting to take shape there. With that thicker. Mm -hmm. So this is the finished product. And I messed up my pinky and my thumb, but this is what it's going to look like when it's finished. We use this for our base coat. We use this for the tip of our nails. We use this to start the glitter gradient. And we use this glitter blue. We use this, the sparkle on top. And the rhinestones that I used. You do not have to use the rhinestones, but it makes it a shinier product. And I know this is not... Can we see your rhinestones before you move on? Nice. And I know this is not connected to what I was trying to show you, but these are my pumpkins. And they are not just ordinary pumpkins. They're glow-in-the-dark nail polish. So, have a good day, and please subscribe. Bye!